a patient's guide to the PICO single-use negative pressure wound therapy system. They say that time heals all wounds, but sometimes it takes a bit more. That's why your healthcare provider has prescribed the PICO single-use negative pressure wound therapy system. The PICO system is used after surgery to promote wound healing, which may reduce the risk of complications like infection. The PICO system can also be used on wounds that aren't improving with standard treatment. While standard dressings only cover your wound or incision, the PICO system goes further with a dressing that offers advanced wound or incision protection. It comes with a pocket-sized battery-powered pump that creates suction, which supports processes that lead to helping your body grow new tissue. Now let's take a look at everything that comes with your PICO system. The specific components include the dressing, the pump, tubing that connects them, batteries to power the pump, and a belt clip for portability. Your healthcare provider will apply the dressing, which attaches to the pump with plastic tubing. On the pump, you'll see a compartment for batteries and a power button. This is how your healthcare provider will start your therapy. You'll know that your PICO system pump is working correctly when the green light located at the top of the device is flashing. Note also that the pump features a series of lights that will alert you to the status of your device. The PICO system also comes with a belt clip to make it easier to take with you on the go. Now that you know a little bit more about what the PICO system is, let's talk about what you can expect from this treatment. After the dressing is applied, you'll keep it in place for up to seven days or as instructed by your healthcare provider. If you've been prescribed the PICO 7 system, the pump will shut off at seven days. If you've been prescribed the PICO 14 system, your dressing will need to be changed after seven days or as instructed by your healthcare provider but your pump will keep working for up to 14 days. Worried about discomfort? In multiple surveys, patients have reported that the PICO system is comfortable to wear. However, when the pump is started, you may feel a slight pulling or drawing sensation. Questions about operating your device? The following tips can help. If the leak indicator light comes on or you hear a buzzing sound, try the following tips. Smooth down around the outside of your dressing, including the strips with your hands to remove any creases. Make sure that the tube connectors have been twisted together securely. Press the orange button to restart your therapy. If the air leak remains, the orange leak indicator will flash again after approximately 60 seconds. The dressing full indicator light on the pump will tell you when your dressing needs to be changed. Note that while you may see some staining on your dressing, you should rely on the dressing full indicator light, the seven day dressing wear time, or your healthcare provider's discretion to know when your dressing should be changed. If the low battery indicator light comes on, simply replace the two AA batteries and press the orange button to restart therapy. If your pump has stopped working, that could mean one of three things. One, you're in standby mode. Press the orange button to restart. Two, the batteries need to be replaced. Three, you've reached the end of your seven or 14 day course of therapy. If none of these situations apply, contact our helpline for assistance. If you've dropped the pump or gotten it wet, you may see that all lights are illuminated. This means the pump is no longer operational and you'll need to contact your healthcare provider for further instruction. Call your nurse or doctor immediately if you see the dressing fill rapidly with blood, the skin around your dressing increases in redness, irritation, or swelling, or your pain increases. The dressing feels or appears loose. The PICO system was designed with patient convenience in mind. You may shower while wearing the PICO system dressing, but be sure to first disconnect the pump and keep it in a safe, dry place. The dressing is water resistant, but don't submerge it in water or expose it to direct spray. You'll need to continue to wear your PICO system while you sleep, but the pump is quiet and most patients aren't disturbed by it. Your dressing may be changed or removed in your healthcare provider's office by a home health nurse or as directed by your healthcare provider. If you have any questions about the PICO system device that haven't been addressed in this video, please call our helpline at 1-800-876-1261 to speak to a registered nurse.